Hello guys. Okay, so <clears throat> I just had somebody come and pick some stuff up from me from OfferUp. And you guys remember the doors that I had that were frosted? Um, I'll try to link if I can a picture of them somewhere in here. But remember those frosted doors that I was so gung-ho about? They made me feel like this Asian theme or whatever I can do in the room. But they wouldn't fit. So I had to go get these French doors that we have now that I'm going to frost out. So I'm holding the camera. This sucks. But anyways, so someone came to put a deposit on them and she's going to pick them up tomorrow. I was in my garage and I'm like, I got so much freaking stuff that I need to refurbish for my house. And I still got a couple pieces that are sitting at the guy that I showed you that I go get a lot of stuff from my offer up. Um, I'll put a link if I can remember, gosh, in the bottom of when I went and okay, brought y'all with me to show y'all all the good stuff he has. So let me show y'all my garage and why I'd be overwhelmed and I love seeing y'all projects. I'm like, oh, I want to get something done. I want to get something done. But the essentials of the house is like more important right now. So come with me. Let me show y'all. Okay. First, let's start off with these bad boys. I got these from OfferUp. If you are on my page, DIY Decor More, the link is below. I got six of these. I only needed three, so I sold three. I ended up selling the other three for way more than I paid for all six. I ended up getting all six of these stools for $35. They are very heavy, and they are custom made. I cannot find out who the maker is. Do y'all see that? I can't find out who the maker is, and they actually came in this blue and black. I'm going to, I just took them out of the garage because I um, had to go show the lady the doors I was selling on offer up. So I'm going to wipe these down. I'm thinking because I got the black up here, I'm going to keep them black. But I'm going to go with like a chrome bottom. What you guys think? I was going to do yellow, but I think it's going to clash with the gold because my live, my kitchen is going to be yellow and blue. Like the this color blue. But... I think I'm going to change that. I got chrome spray and I had it down in the basement for a couple, about a year now because I bought it before we moved, even moved here. So I'm going to do chrome bottoms and clean them up and try to refurbish and restore this um, top. It's just dusty from in the garage and it was a box sitting on that one. I'm just showing y'all right out of the garage. I got to vacuum that stuff off. And they are very sturdy and these are really thick. Like, let me show y'all. Do y'all see that? These are really thick, old school stools. I just don't know who made them. And I don't know if the person that my husband went and picked them up for me, because this is when I was working part time, he went and picked these up. So I don't know if they made them, but they have like faces on them. Do y'all see that? They have faces on them. And I thought those were so neat and I had to have them. So I have these three and these will be a DIY. Let me show y'all the garage to show y'all my frustration. <laughs> Okay, these two chairs, if you are my DIY decor page, you will see I got these months ago. And I'm going to be changing them to a dark charcoal gray or either black. And I want to use those in my living room. This is the other one here. That's the other one here. Um, and they're just dusty from the garage. But these are nice chairs. And I got both of these chairs for 30 bucks on offer up. These are the doors. It's one door there, a big door, and a small door here that I just sold. I got these chairs that I'm selling um, on excuse me, on offer up as well. They're two big antique chairs. Got another one here. I got these two club chairs that I want to keep and utilize. And if you can see, is one down there and one right here, and I got both of those for 40 bucks. Then I have two of these tables, which I brought one in the house, and these are just surface scratches. Those aren't even nothing I'm worried about because if I stain it or paint it, it'll be down. I like those, but I think I might want to change the legs because I don't that's not going with the theme of my house. I have dressers. I have these three things. I don't know if y'all remember that I shared these with y'all. I got these from Lazy Boy. They were um marked down to ten dollars a piece. I got this one. That circle one and that one. And then I got these Art Deco 
um, tables. Y'all see those? Those are really nice. And I got both of those for $20, okay? Got those. This is the other chair. I also got an offer up. I got two of these. The other one is in a room with this table that I'm using to edit my videos and stuff. So I got two of these. Do y'all see this lamp? Old school with the glass down there. I'm thinking about putting a square um, shade on it and changing that gold or silver and having that in a corner with a nice accent chair. I got a cedar chest that I wanted to put in my husband's man, um, like the family room slash his TV, man cave, whatever. Um, I wanted to put that in there um, and do his theme of his um, favorite uh, NFL team. I have a corner bar, that thing that I want to turn into a corner bar right there. I also have that that I'm going to put in my mud room and paint and repaint so we can put our boots and stuff in it. I have those lamps that I got and these y'all know almost over well actually not almost over a year ago these freaking lamps I went and priced them they're from regular calor I went and priced these lamps and those lamps for one lamp is uh, $398 and I got two of them from Habitat so check out your Habitat I also have a buffet right there I found this chair in the trash and I was gonna refurbish and sell it I have this that I found in the trash that is extremely heavy and y'all y'all should have seen me trying to get that in my car this I redid which got dirty in the construction and I have a gold chair there I have this chair here and I have another another buffet which is like an octagon shape and I can't really could y'all see that I don't know if I'm getting any details but it's nice and long so guys I've been trying to get rid of stuff in here I got a bar cart that's been in here for oh gosh uh over a year I got a lot of stuff I got pallets that I purchased to do projects with do y'all see what I'm saying that's why I cannot wait to get this cleared out cleaned up put what I'm selling to one side put the other stuff to the other side and this stuff back there that I can't even get to and he's coming to repair this because it's baroque so we got to be real careful but yeah so that's the garage and those are all my diys waiting for my house i think i'm gonna utilize that one right there this one here for my back of my sofa couch yeah that's what i think i'm gonna do with that one this one might be my actual buffet in the dining room and then the corner one also as a little bar i don't know we'll figure it out when the time comes y'all see my gazebo that's been sitting there for over a year that i got from sam's club so upset i cannot wait till the summer comes and i can put that up and my boxing um my boxing stand for my 100 pound boxing bag when i get back in the swing of things and do my thousand punch challenge it will be with a real boxing bag like i use in the gym so this is my messy garage and all my diys and construction stuff all over the darwin place so yeah guys I wanted to share that with you guys <laughs> so as you can see your girl got a lot to do I cannot wait to be able to do those things in here um but you know something i just got this real peace over me that i'm excited that i'm even in here and we just take our time and do what we need to do take our time to make it how we want to and all that good stuff so y'all see all my clutter over there stuff that i gotta mark on ebay and stuff that just i've been boxes of construction stuff and just things just everywhere so it's kind of cluttered not so so bad but yeah that irritates me but yeah i just want to share that with you guys you guys thoughts on the bar stools what you think the chrome with the black i think that'll be nice because of the lights up here um that's probably gonna be my first little thing because the kitchen is basically almost done i just can't wait for this grungy ugly door oh let me show y'all if y'all don't remember it y'all see that I cannot wait for that grungy, ugly door to be replaced with my baby right here. I cannot wait, cannot wait. Those carpet tack strips and all that stuff. Still got carpet and doors and just stuff still sitting all over the place for construction. So, yeah. But I'm loving, I'm loving how it looks. I'm really loving how it looks. And that door just makes it, make it look disgusting to me. But... 
Oh well, um, hope you guys are enjoying my channel and enjoying my videos. Thumbs up for more videos and thumbs um subscribe if you haven't and share, share. Love you guys. Me and my hubby gotta go get the kids and run some errands and I'm planning a trip for the kids. And you guys will be coming. Me and my hubby planning something. Just a couple day getaway. We always try to. If you're not following me on Instagram, you can check out our last little family fun time. This time, we're going somewhere else. And I'm um, going to have a, like a three-way getaway with the kids to someplace really fun. And I know they're going to enjoy it. So, yep. All right, guys. Let me go. It's time for us to go pick them up. Talk to you guys later. Remember, stick to your script. Because you're the best at it. Later, guys. Okay.